In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to log hours, time or work details under a ticket in JIRA. Now, keeping track of your work is crucial for project management and JIRA provides a seamless way to manage your time effectively. So let's get started first. You'll want to navigate to the specific JIRA issue or task you've been working on. This step is vital because it ensures that the time and details you're logging are accurately attributed to the correct task. Once you've located the issue, look towards the top right corner. Here you'll see an icon represented by three dots. This menu contains several options related to your task management. Go ahead and click on those three dots. A drop down menu will appear, presenting you with various options. From this list, you'll need to select Log Work. This option might seem straightforward, but it's a critical function that opens the door to capturing your work efforts. Once you've selected Log Work, you'll be prompted to enter your work details. This includes a few key pieces of information, starting with the time you've spent. It's important to enter the time in the HMD format, where you can note hours, minutes and even days. For instance, if you worked for three and a half hours, you would enter it as 3H 30 mim. This format ensures clarity and consistency in how time is logged across all tasks. Next, you have the option to enter the time remaining if that's something relevant to your task. This can help in project planning, giving you and your team an idea of what's left to be completed. It's a small step, but one that can significantly impact how your workload is viewed. Another important field is the date started. Here, you'll specify when the work was done. Depending on your JIRA settings, this may or may not be available, but if it is, it provides a precise timeline of your task management, allowing for better project oversight. Additionally, there's a field for a work description. Although this is optional, adding a few details about the work completed can be incredibly beneficial. It provides context and specifics, helping anyone viewing the ticket to understand exactly what was accomplished during the logged time, plus it can be a helpful reminder for yourself, providing a snapshot of your past work whenever you need a refresher. Finally, the last step is to click save to record the time. This crucial action ensures that all your inputs are finalised and stored within the task, ready for review by you or your team. And there you have it, a comprehensive guide to logging your work in JIRA, making sure your efforts are accounted for and easily accessible within your project timeline.